we're going to follow um, this booklet to do the first subject on the candle using the practice shun. And if you have uh, moisture control issues, then I would recommend to use one of the double shun or J play. The brushes, I will use a large combination brush, which I have here, either a super flow or um, double happiness, which I love the tip of it. So today I'm going to use the double happiness. Color, I have three different red. Start with the vermilion and red and rouge, which is a deeper red. And uh, so you can use other, uh, your own palette, as long as there is um, three uh, different um, color variation. And um, then we would do the pine, need, uh, pine needle, um, use either pine needle brush or mountain horse fine. So I load vermilion first on the first color and then uh, red and then the dark red and I blend. And I turn the paper sideways to do the body of the candle. Using the flow brush to do the fire on the candle. So I have yellow and with a little vermilion, a little red. Now I switch my um, to my um, large double happiness. If you have a smaller brush, that would do too. So I will uh, finish the fire on the handle is a little bit like this, and then I will do the. Then I will use um, a mountain horse. This one is a little bit bigger than usual, but I would suggest if you are a beginner, use mountain horse fine or pine needle brush. So I load light, lighter color green, and then darker color green, and then blend. So then I do And that's it for this candle subject. So we're going to do holly. So three, I'm going to use three brushes 
I'm going to use the um, Super Flow and Mountain Horse Small for the leaves. And for the berry, I'm going to use the Flow Brush and um, for the stem of the holly plant. So I'm loading the super flow with yellow and light green and dark green and make sure you are blended. And then I'm going to do the first leaf. Second one is kind of it's a folded one. And then the third one also is a folded one. And then um, the edge of the holly leaf is the one that I had the most trouble. So I really practice a lot. So I'm going to um, take a little time to explain it. So it started from the stain, the bottom, the leaves, and then I'm using the mountain horse small, and then I go like a half U shape. And then the second stroke, I'm going underneath the first U. And then the third stroke. And on the other side. So make sure your U is connected with the body of the leaf. So it's from the where the leaves is coming from the snap, the bottom of the uh, connected with the tree. So then I connect this leaf with that. Okay, and then now we're going to the berries. So there's two group of berries. So I loaded my brush with vermilion and red and the dark red. Then I have a little dry ink here, so I tip the red with a little ink and do the stem. OK, 
Okay, so then I'm going to do the stem. So I use a little green, a little red, and then a little ink. So I'm following this berry to connect it with this leaf. Second stem is connected with the top of the one. So then I'm done. Oh, I forgot. I need to add the step, the center wing of the leaves. So this time I'm going to use the mountain horse brush and then I'm going to use the iridescent color. I'm sorry, it's called Pro Lesson. Pearl Lesson. And then I'm going to use one of the warm color. I'm going to go soften. So that's the holly. <laughs> 